they had moved in, bought a place above Emerson out here. That last house on the right, they just passed Doug's place in Emerson down there. Anything. You can make anything can be made out of a piece of wood uh -huh. or out of a piece of metal. He made chairs for years, and straight back chairs and all, the rocking chairs and all. Uh -huh. And for those chairs, he only got a dollar a piece for them back then. He had a truck and all that people come there and buy him, you know, and the one that cost you four to five dollars a piece, he'd get a quarter for it. If he didn't, he'd give it to you. Uh -huh. He never got over 50 cents to a dollar for the biggest one, weighed 30, 40 pound a piece. I went to Ackworth Elementary and then there, and then from there to Kennesaw, and I didn't get too much of education, you know, about sixth, seventh grade. Uh -huh. Had to help on the farm and all. Uh -huh. Then I went to work at Boom's Ace Hardware and Sherman's uh, Economy Auto then, okay. in Ackworth. Okay. Yeah, I hard in on Saturday. Told me to come in Monday, and I said, well, what's the working hours? He said, now we work six days a week, six o'clock to six o'clock, if we finish. Oh. If we don't, we're seven, eight, or nine, whatever time we finish. Uh -huh. And he says, I'll uh, give you a two weeks trial if, at $40 a week. If you prove out, you'll go to, I'll keep you. Uh -huh. If you prove out on that there, he says, you'll go to 45 in that two weeks. Okay. And I went in Monday and worked till Friday morning, went in down there and parked beside the station where I parked and got out and him and Buddy met me, the son. And he went and uh, said, you know what I told you about that work? I said, yeah. He said, now you started at 45. And I worked several years, $45 a week that way. Wow. Six days a week. Wow. Enjoyed every minute of it. But 12 hours and more a day? Yeah, 12 hours a day. And I stayed with him 15 years. And my wife, she was blown up there where we went together. Uh -huh. But when we started going together, I met her, I worked over at that unique knitting mill, you know, and yeah. them girls, she had out there, and two more girls, Grady Priest was the boss, you know, and a, get Doris Garrison at that time. Mm -hmm. They'd meet the bus, and I, when I started in to work, they'd be standing there waiting on the bus, they'd wave at me. I told Grady Priest one morning, I said, I'm gonna go out here every time of you and speak to one of these girls about a date, you know. Mm -hmm. Take her out to the movie on, on uh, Friday night, you know, it was Hudson had a movie theater here in Ackbar. Okay. And we went to the movie. And then when we come back in that night, I asked her, I said, can I see you next Saturday, Friday night or Saturday? She said, you ain't coming back going to church with me tomorrow? I said, yeah, I'll be here. <laughs> and that's the way it started. I see. <laughs> the week that me and my wife married in 54, March 6, 54, I brought home $12 and a half that week. Then I went down to the preacher at was Orange Hill Church, Irving Brown, he married us, and he asked me, he said, I asked him how much else, he said, whatever you think she's worth. I said, she's worth a lot of money, <laughs> but I ain't got much, and I gave him $3 to marry us. Well, that was a lot when you That's a lot of money, $12 and a half a week that week. Never did make much. Yeah. I've seen the city change from start to finish.